Hey guys, it's me, William Herning, and I'm back with another video. So today's video, it is late at night, but, um, I'm about to show you guys how to, um, basically fix your eBoot error on a, um, on this emulator. So, let's get into it. First of all, your issue when you have this emulator problem is that you have no firmware. I discovered eBoot errors or dot bin your eBoot errors are caused by not having a firmware. To fix that you click hold on. To fix that you click install firmware, then you'll get this popping up. You usually it'll be in your downloads, but I don't have a firmware because I already installed it, but it would be in here somewhere. Okay, after you select your firmware, it'll say installing. Once it's done, you can install that, and then you can install your games either way, package or zip. And then, instead of the eBoot error coming up, you should be able to play your games now. I'll just give you a demonstration of what my games would look like so you can test it out for yourself. Alright, I'm going to use Run Sackboy Run as an example. There we go. This is going to pop up, but totally ignore that. Okay. As I said, it should run normally. So you just play your game normally. Um, I'll give a little demonstration how it works. Mine won't be as good as yours, though, because... I'm playing on a low-end PC, but hopefully I can play pretty good. Okay. If you want to see gameplay of this on my channel, I definitely do that. But today is not a gameplay video. Today is just to describe how to fix eBoot errors. But yeah, you get the point. My name is William Crane. That was a quick video how to fix an eBoot error. If you want to see more of this videos, make sure to like and subscribe. My name is Ryan. Thank you for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Peace.